At the beginning of the pandemic, there was a glimmer of hope treating patients with COVID with convalescent plasma. But now a new study says it doesn't work. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez reports. It was hopeful in the beginning when doctors had very little with which to treat COVID patients. So when a small handful of patients recovered, the theory was that their plasma contained neutralizing antibodies that could be extracted and given to newly infected patients. For a while, it seemed to work. There were reports of COVID patients recovering after being given the so-called convalescent plasma. But various studies on the plasma were all over the place, some apparently helping and others failing to benefit the patient. Now, in what may be the definitive randomized study on convalescent plasma has just been released in Nature Medicine today. We stopped using convalescent plasma months and months ago. It just simply doesn't work. And the trials really have failed to demonstrate any benefit. Dr. Thomas Balsasak is the chief medical officer for Yale New Haven Health. He says that not only does convalescent plasma not work, the study also suggests that it could cause harm. I think this new trial that came out yesterday is probably the final nail in the coffin on convalescent plasma as a treatment because it also suggests that there's the real potential for harm. Uh, not just lack of benefit, and that's really concerning. The harm could come from all the other accumulated antibodies when you collect plasma from the donor. And those antibodies could theoretically react in the recipient, causing other unintended side effects. It's just unclear what that potential for harm could be while not conferring any benefit. That's what doctors want to avoid. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.